Hi, my name is John White and in this video series I plan on showing you how to create a, a basic MVC framework using PHP. So in this episode we're just going to do the basic setup. We won't actually do much coding but for, it'll help us you know, be ready for the future episodes. So let's get started. So MVC framework is going to need a few folders. First one being application. Second being controllers. We're going to need some models. We're going to need some views. Let's make a, a lib folder for all of our CSS or whatever. Let's just add a CSS folder inside the lib folder. There's some sort of issue there. Okay. Oh. <laughs> right, now we're going to we're going to uh, just add some files the folders. So what we're going to do is uh, application. So we're going to have a request.php inside our application folder. So request.php. We're going to have a router.php. We're going to have a base controller. Oh, sorry. We'll get to all these files in future episodes. We have a base model.php. We have a registry.php. We're going to have a, um, a world.php. So let's let's um, we'll just make a, a, a test model. We'll move into models. So let's pretend we're making a blog, as that seems very popular for a tutorial. So we're probably going to need a, a posts model. PHP. Yep. Let's make a controller as well. Controllers. I'm going to make an index controller.php. And also, let's just make a, a style.css as well, just for. So hopefully we've got. Oh, we should make a view here. Well, sorry, I've got a bit of view. CD. Um, now let's go back. One. And views. We'll just make a index view. You know that. Okay. And so we've got files. Let's just include them all. By the way, this is a Vim backup file, so it's got nothing really to do with the uh, tutorial. Let's include all these files. We're going to need uh, a side path. So let's define a side path. And that's going to be real path. Dern in. Inside that, we're going to do file. Like okay. So let's add a, a, a forward slash to the end of that. Let's require, you know, let's make a comment first. Require unnecessary files. Okay, so we'll do oops, require underscore once side path. Let's require a request. It's going to be in our application folder. Request. Just check if I've not made any mistakes. Nope, oh, all good. So let's require the rest of them so we're going to have a router. We're going to have a base controller. We're going to have a base model. We're going to have a load. <laughs> Best lord. <laughs> no, just just lord. And we're gonna need our registry. Okay, let's make sure I've not made any mistakes there. Okay, so let's just check that they're all included. So we'll do that's that's the shock I've got in Vim, so don't worry about that. Get included underscore files. So 
that's it. So we've got all our files included and that's about it for this tutorial. So in the next tutorial I'm going to elaborate on the base controller and the base model to show you how they work and we'll probably uh, add to our model and controller. So thanks for watching. See you next time.